Hello and welcome to this mod first look video. Today we're going to be looking at the Steel Hall by LQM. So let's jump in and have a look. So for this one we are going in under Sheds because I believe there are two versions of this and I'm not sure if it's coming out as a option, as in customization, or whether it just is as it is, and I believe it is as it is. So we are going to put one, we're going to put them next to each other actually. That'll be fine. So I want to put one square on here. It's got quite a nice uh, little footprint on that. That's nice. I like that. So then the next one, I'm assuming, as one shouldn't, is... Oh, we've still got all the other sheds still active. Is over here. And this is with storage. So you've got the steel hall and then you've got steel hall storage. Um, the steel hall and steel hall storage both weigh 45 thousand i want to put it this way because it looks like that's where the triggers are for me and i'm also going to try and line them up there we go not too bad yeah both cost forty-five thousand. they are 30 each on upkeep and the storage shed has capacity for bale storage and for pallets and that's uh 1200 units so now that they're down, let's get over and have a good look at them. Again, I don't know where the, the sun's right above us. We never have good light. You always have to get the torch out. Madness. Um, yeah. Nice steel shed. That's cool, actually. I like that. And both of them are all the way through. We'll have a little run around the outside. I like to do the outsides and have a look at the innards. It's inside what counts, but, you know, we like to have a pretty outside too. I like that we're seeing this, like, the pinning of the steel in the sheet there. That's that's pretty cool. Frame is looking nice as well. Same for both. Exactly the same. It's just the functionality that we have that's different. But very nice. We can see this side without the torch so much. Sits on its feet. An inch or two off the ground, letting the air flow through. And as you can see, we've got our drop off here and our triggers there. So one assumes again that they're just going to appear out the front. But yeah, really nice. Look good. Again, I like that some of this this paint on the girders looks like it's a little bit worn. It's it's been on there a bit. So you guys let me know. I keep saying that. Is it just my eyes? Is it just my bad eyes make things look old? But yeah, this this looks nice. I like that. So it's those little details up there. That's why I like. Oh, and behind here, that you wouldn't you wouldn't normally come in and have a look at that. But look at that. The joining is is there. I like that that extra detail is there. It's nice. It's that sort of stuff that adds to the realism of your game as you're going around your sheds and as you're in and out and doing things. It's just. Being able to just see them off in your periphery is really nice. So let's go get some bales and uh, we'll check this one out and see it's uh, fully working and functioning. And again, helping us with the bales today, we have the Stias 6200 and our Arcusin. Um, no particular preference over these other than the colours match. That's why I keep using it. <laughs> so we'll, we'll back this in. it an unload and they should all go in there nicely like I say 1200 capacity that's a lot of bales that's a lot of pallets you can put in mixed as you can with uh, I think all the storage sheds to be fair and there they be there's our bales all the way at the back lovely job and I am assuming sorry about banging my wheel there I am assuming that they are not physical. We're going to drive through. What's this uh, canola in this field, I think? Drive through our canola. Not physical? No. I don't have a problem with that. I just like testing it. I like to see if I can... If I, if I, if I put 1,200 bales in it, what could I hide in it? <laughs> That's what I'm thinking all the time. It's so good. It's cool. I like it. 
but that is the steel hall and the steel hall storage shed by lqm really nice set of sheds these i think they fit in on any farm in any play style really good hopefully you enjoyed them hopefully you get to have some fun with them remember to download them from the mod hub support the modders go to the legitimate places if you've enjoyed this video give it a big fat thumbs up down below if you're new to the channel hit the subscribe button turn the bell notification on find out when new videos are going live as always comments and feedback down there you guys have a wonderful day and hopefully i'll see you again soon bye bye